Good morning, muchachos. It is 9.06 a.m. Starting the vlog early today. I um, was, I start, was bleh, hmm, English. I was trying to edit my vlog from yesterday and then I realized I was gonna make the pot roast today and I was looking like, okay, well, how long does it take? Because sometimes you don't have to start your like slow cooker first thing in the morning because you know it only will take like four hours, but no, the pot roast that says it has to be cooked on high for at least eight hours. So I need to start that now because it's nine o'clock. So I'm trying to get all of the ingredients out Good morning, Daddy. He done literally just woke up. Alondra woke him up, and what did she say that her stomach was growling? No, she's like, come on, wake up, you gave me French toast. Oh, she's so excited for Edom to make her French toast, so she woke him up. But anyway, so I'm just trying to grab all the ingredients. I know I need the two cans of cream of mushroom. You know what? I should have bought two more cans because, like I said, I think I said this in our last grocery haul. I always want to keep this stuff like on hand at the house because I feel like a lot of recipes call for that. And I was right. So anyways, I need this. What else do I need? I need the beef broth. Let's see, what do you need? I need the carrots, the beef broth, the mushroom soup, four large claws of oven, blah, blah, blah. Okay, we're good. All right, I'm gonna get my ingredients, start getting everything ready to go. That way I can get that in the slow cooker and then that way I can work on the vlog. Okay, here's all the ingredients for the pot roast. So I got the rump roast, salt, pepper to season that. Oregano, we got the two cans of cream of mushroom beef broth, carrots, which I'm gonna chop up. I might use more, it just depends. An onion, and then it says four cloves of garlic, but I'm just gonna use five because why not? You might be noticing that the potatoes are missing, and yes, they are. Trust me, there will be potatoes, but instead of throwing in like, you know, like the small honey gold type, you know, potatoes, you know, that's supposed to signify the size of the potato, in case you're wondering what I was doing. Now you know. Anyways, though, Edom prefers all of this on top of mashed potatoes. So that's how we do pot roast here. So, all right, I'm going to go ahead and get all the ingredients together. All right, and there she is, you guys. The pot roast is done. Just kidding. It's not eight hours later. By the way, we decided to still use the little potatoes, cut them in half. We just didn't use the whole bag because we'll also do mashed potatoes. But all right, now to put this in our little slow cooker thingamajig on high for eight hours. We're leaving Ross. I didn't vlog in Ross though because we were on a mission to find Crocs, but this Ross only had one pair of Crocs, not in her size, and they weren't pink, so Alondra didn't want them. Alondra's very much been saying how she needs new Crocs, which is true, she does. Um, well, she doesn't need them necessarily. She loves Crocs and her Crocs are like two sizes too small, so. Anyways, but they are good though crocs in general for like just throwing on and going and like going to the pool and stuff Because we are gonna get Alondra in swim lessons and Edom and I were just talking about like what summer activities we're gonna put her in And things like that, but we stopped at Ross real quick because Ross usually well in California They usually sell crocs and they had a bunch of options, but I don't know if maybe because it's just now like spring If maybe that's why they don't really have a lot of options, but it's also it is taking forever to open the pool. But um, the Ross is in the same, what do you call it? Here, you wanna? Here, I'll push you guys right here. So the Ross is in this shit. <laughs> the Ross is in at the same shopping center as Winko, so it kind of worked out good just to like stop real quick and see if they had the goods, but they didn't. So our search continues. Um, but anyways, I mean, obviously I could always just go to the Croc store. It's not that big of a deal, but you know, if I can save a little bit of, a money I want to so all right we are headed to it's kind of funny that we're gonna go grocery shopping today even though I did grocery shopping yesterday but um, I just I don't know we just need more stuff you know as we were looking we're like okay well we want to make this 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 we need to buy this 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 you guys know I don't know anyway so we're headed to Winko then after Winko we are gonna go to Costco and then that is all that we have planned huh I don't we don't really have anything else planned oh I do that's okay. What is this chick doing? Am I going down the wrong lane? No. So what is she doing? I don't know. She has to move over. Go. And you have to get closer this way too. Ah. Anyways. So we do need to pick up my prescription though at Target. So do it, I need... we need shampoo. Oh yeah, we need shampoo. But when did they say I could pick it up? Because I know you said you set it up for like automatic renew or whatever like that. So I can pick it up. Are you, how many do you have left? I, well, I have one left, will be tonight. Okay. So that yeah, means baby. I can pick it up tonight? Should yes, baby, to. we're gonna get you juice. They haven't called you? 
No. We can call. We can call and ask? Yeah, that way they could start having it ready. Okay. So then, yeah, we'll also go, ah, oh, this person's door is open. All right, let's find a different parking spot. Ugh. Remember right next to that white sewer bin? Okay, I won't do that. I hate parking spots. I know. I hate driving, and I hate looking for parking lots. We have red boxes on T-Mobile Tuesday. Oh, yeah, I've got mine yesterday, but. Yeah, I have one, too, so. I don't think there's anything I want to get at red box, so. Is there anything you want to get? I haven't looked. I don't know. I, don't, I looked when your brother was here and nothing looked interesting. All right, anyway, so we're just having random conversations now. All right, we're here at Winka. We're gonna go inside, get our goods, and then head to Le Casco. All right, one meltdown over shopping cart later. We are finally inside Winko. Oh my God, her and shopping carts, I swear. One thing I love about Winko, well, honestly, there's multiple things I love about Winko, is this though, this section here. So like, for instance, we need to get beans, but we just get the beans and like you put them in a bag. What is this called? When you don't bulk, bulk I guess, yeah. And like we need macaroni pasta, um, like the elbow kind because we're gonna make macaroni pasta for our mole that we're gonna have this week. And we were like, oh my gosh, they had the elbow macaroni here. And so yeah, I don't know, I just love that. So we're gonna get the beans and then this. So yeah, I definitely wanna start doing like this, like buying like more mason jars that I have and just like getting like, you know, like this kind of stuff. I don't know, I just, I really like it. And I mean, look at all this other stuff over here that they have, which is like kind of crazy. Like hemp hearts, wheat, more wheat. I mean, like I have so much like different type of just, I don't know, it's really cool. And like all this like pizza crust mix, powdered sugar, brown sugar. They just have so much, and like all this stuff for baking too. I don't know, I think it's a really good idea. Hey babe, speaking of baking, do we need chocolate chips? No. Will you have some? Okay, cause that would be a good idea, look. And they have a bunch of different kinds of chocolate chips too. Gotta keep this in mind for sure. That's why I don't like parking lots. See that white I car don't. right there, you guys? It just hit another car that was driving by. The poor old guy who's packed down and walked right into her. But yeah, he, this is why I don't like parking lots, y'all. He looked mad. Huh? He looked mad. He looked no. He was like, I'm really sorry oh, about that. He, he looked nervous. Oh. I felt really bad for him. He was like, I'm really sorry about that. He looked really nervous. It was like it's okay. Uh, yeah, she was like, ah, oh, it's okay, whatever. Oh, here she it, comes right now. Shh. This car took the damage. <laughs> yeah, it did. I didn't see anything on hers. Let's, let's see if we get her on camera walking by, muchacho. Can't forget Gorda's juice. <laughs> We're so nosy. <laughs> All right, muchachos. Next stop is Costco. And tell me why it is 12 o'clock and the parking lot is crazy full. And it's a Thursday. Like, I have no idea what is going on. But, like, literally, all the rows are full and we packed or parked, excuse me, way down yonder. So, Anyways, we only have like three things on our list and I've talked about this before that like, I love Costco for the deals, but I personally hate going into a Costco because of the crowds and all that. So I already know I'm gonna leave here extra cranky. So hopefully we can just get in and out. Please begin scanning. We survived Costco. We got everything on the list, which was only three things. Then we only bought one additional thing because someone needs deodorant so anyways um yeah we got everything on our list now oh shoot we didn't call target i need to call target huh so i can find out because we also do need shampoo but at costco they only sell moisturizing shampoo and i have the greasiest hair ever known to man and yeah i can't do moisturizing because i do not need moisture that is for sure so, all right let me go ahead do I just call like Target what? Like the um, pharmacy? All right, let me call them and see if my prescription is ready. It's been a little bit since we've checked in. It is three o'clock. I just got done like doing all of the dishes. We've had lunch. Yes, and Daddy and Alondra are having ice cream. And I'm so excited, you guys. We just bought our tickets to see Avengers the Endgame. We're not gonna see it tonight. Exactly, we're gonna see it tomorrow morning because we know tonight is gonna be really crowded. Iram, I didn't see this. Um, actually, I didn't say much yesterday when he got home, but he had like a headache all day yesterday and Iram gets migraines, not frequently. I feel like you haven't had like a migraine in a while. I used to get them a lot more often. Yeah, but I feel like you haven't got him in a while, but it's not a migraine or anything, but he's been having a headache since yesterday and today he has like 
a headache. So good thing I got that in the PO box um, from you. Thank you again, Miss Caddy. Edam has been putting it on his head and trying it out. So anyways, yeah, we also don't want to go to the movies because of that. I want him to be able to enjoy himself. But we got our tickets for tomorrow morning and I am so excited. We're going at 10, 10 a.m., baby? 10, 10 a.m. tomorrow? What time are we going tomorrow? 10. <laughs> I didn't know what you were saying. <laughs> Oh my gosh. So anyways, yeah, we're going tomorrow at 10, so we'll just need to make sure. It's one of those places that you, um, what do you call it? You, what is it called? It's, it's not like an AMC or anything. It's a studio, studio movie grill. Yeah, movie theater. That's what it's called. Thank you, Corda. <laughs> but it's one of those where you can actually order food, but you have to get there early to order food. We're not going to do that. Plus the movie is like three hours long. I'm not trying to go to the bathroom and I don't want a laundry to go to the bathroom. So literally we're just gonna have, cause it's a long movie. And if you have to go to the bathroom, that means mommy's gonna have to take you and I'm gonna miss the movie. Ay yay yay. So we have yeah, we have to wear diapers. And two, I'm a little nervous because I got my period. So, oh yeah, by the way, I didn't mention it all yesterday, but um, I, I know I said, not yesterday, but the day before, so when Alondra and I went to Crayola, I said I was late on my period. I was technically like two days late, but um, I'm not pregnant, obviously. False alarm, you guys. I, um, I, yeah, I don't know. I didn't think I was pregnant, honestly, but I've tried to stop being like, ooh, I wonder if I'm pregnant, I wonder if I'm pregnant. Like, I've just stopped. And I stopped taking pregnancy tests too because I used to take pregnancy tests like the day before my period was supposed, not like this, but my period was supposed to come. And I just stopped doing that because I'm like, whatever, I'm not going to take a pregnancy test unless I'm like two weeks late or something. So anyways, and I had a feeling too my period was going to be a little messed up because of the progesterone because I've finally been on it a full month as of today will be a full month. So I hit myself in the face. Um, but anyways, so yeah. Um... Yeah, I got my period yesterday. So hopefully tomorrow will be day three on my period. So hopefully it won't be like as strong. Cause I really don't want to have to like, I'm not trying to, is this being TMI and gross? But what I'm saying is, is I don't want to go to the bathroom tomorrow during the movie. So I hope uh, I don't have a heavy flow where I have to, but I also don't want to have like blood everywhere. Can you imagine? Ew, that'd be so disgusting. I know that was TMI. That was gross, right? But that's literally what I was thinking about, like worried about. I'm like, of course I would get my period for like a three hour movie. Anyway, sorry guys that I just took you on that nasty journey with me. But um, anyways, yeah, I'm not pregnant, you guys. <gasps> False alarm. I'm sad, but I don't know. I had a feeling. Oh, yes, baby. Mommy will. She said, but you're going to have a baby soon. So, um, but I am going to say, I do feel good. Like, even though I'm not, I, I am on my period. I'm not emotional about it. Usually I'm super, super like upset and sad. And I'm like just an emotional wreck like that day. Yeah, we're going to watch Iron Man. Um, but I don't, I don't feel that way. I actually feel really positive and I feel really good. Like, I just feel like we're taking the right steps to getting pregnant. Well, we've been taking the right steps, but I mean like since seeing the doctor, like I'm, I'm, I'm glad that, you know, I got everything done. I need to get tested. I mean, I might need more, but like as of right now and like as far as like getting my follicle tested, my progesterone tested, I'm glad I'm taking the medicine. And so, yeah. And by the way, my refill is ready. I will just pick it up tomorrow because the movie theater is right by the Target. So we'll just do that tomorrow. And yeah, and then I'll go actually and I'm supposed to take, take my other blood work on cycle day 21. So what is today? Cycle day two? So I'll go in 19 days to get that blood work done and hopefully my progesterone has gone up. But anyways, I'm rambling now. We're gonna watch Iron Man because we're gonna try to knock some movies off of this list here. Um, I watched Captain America just a few months ago at my dad, so we're not gonna do that. So movie number two is Iron Man. So I'm gonna watch that. We're gonna get our Avenger movies on and um, I will check in with you guys later. So it's the next day, you guys. Ignore the TV, uh, if you can. It's Alondra is watching some Disney Junior and having cereal, and it's 8.26 in the morning, and we are getting ready to go to the Avengers movie. It's so funny. Um, Edom and I were saying this morning, I was like, babe, why did we pick a 10 o'clock movie? Like, it's still Friday. We could have gone like, well, today is Friday. I'm like, we could have gone at like 12 or 11 or something. Why 10? He's like, I have no idea. 
I know we are going to the movie theaters. Alondra is so excited that we're going to the movie theaters and she's so excited to see Avengers. She loves the Avengers and Black Widow's her favorite. So yeah, last night we just watched like a Marvel marathon and I just honestly fell asleep. But we watched the first Iron Man we watch The Incredible Hulk. Like the first movie you're supposed to watch on the list is Captain America, then Iron Man, then The Incredible Hulk, then Iron Man 2, then The Avengers. Um, so Captain America I watched a few months ago at my dad's. That's why we didn't watch it and it was still fresh in the brain. And then um, Iron Man we just watched just because, well, you know, Edom is Iron Man, you know? <laughs> so we watched that. Plus there was some stuff I forgot. So I'm glad we watched it. Then The Incredible Hulk, I have not seen since it first came out in movie theaters, and I remember it was like awful graphics, but honestly when I was watching it, it wasn't as bad as I like remembered it being. Although I did realize they changed the actor. It was Edward Norton, and now it's Mark Ruffalo, but I like Mark Ruffalo better. But um, I realized that. But then I'm like, what happened to Liv Tyler? Because that used to be his girlfriend in the movie, and like now he's like, I don't know, has a weird thing with Black Widow. I don't know. Anyways, so... Um, then we went to watch Iron Man 2 and I fell asleep during Iron Man 2. So I'm kind of like, dang it! Because I really wanted to watch the first Avengers. Like, I don't know, I just thought that would be like, that was my goal. But it did not happen because I knocked out. But anyways, I'm rambling and I'm just trying to say goodbye to you guys. But you guys already know, I'm a rambler. So I'm a little nervous. I have not even imported this footage. I don't know if it's going to be a short vlog or not. I feel like short, so... I'm sorry if it is, you guys. But um, anyways, all right, I'm gonna stop talking. I'm gonna import the footage and I need to get ready so we can go to the movies and then start the next vlog. Today's the actual Friday vlog. So anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy today's vlog. Please give this video a thumbs up. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe and I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, muchachos.